Hi, my name is Joey and I am the social and outreach chair slash media director for the biochemistry club and I want you to know that you're awesome and that the biochemistry club is looking for awesome people just like yourself. College is about once in a lifetime experiences and with the biochemistry club you too can travel with us to various K-12 through science nights all around Tucson where we set up interactive demos that the kids find both scientific and fun. We've made so many memories over the years and would love to see you there. Hi guys, my name is Allison and I am the 2021 Biochem Club President. I'm here to show you today one of the demos we do using hydrogen peroxide and the yeast. And as you can tell, I've already added the yeast with a little food coloring, but adding a little bit more will help catalyze that reaction. And kids love watching them foam up. So, cheers! I hope you look forward to joining us. General meetings are held regularly to organize these events. Also, come meet the other officers at one of our meetings and socialize with peers that would love to offer guidance towards your degree. Later in the year, you can join us at Beaker, the Biological Engineering and Chemical Undergraduate Research Conference, and be an important part of running one of the club's most popular events. Beaker is also a fantastic resource to help you prepare for your career in science. As the year comes to an end, the Biochemistry Club also hosts Blast Off, a summer science camp for middle school students. This week-long event is a wonderful volunteer experience, and you could truly make an impact on these kids' lives. The Biochemistry Club would be honored to have you with us, so give it a try and make your mark here at the University. Join the Biochemistry Club today! Hello, we're the Chemistry Club, and we're here to find and connect people who also love chemistry. We do a lot of outreach focused on doing events at schools, putting on magic shows, using our demos to interest kids in science. We got a little bit of a demo for you guys, a small taste of what our club is about. Um, but real quick, I want to make sure you guys have a way to get in contact with us. So you can get in touch through Instagram with Smacks Arizona or Facebook of UVA Chemistry Club or send us an email at smacksarizona at gmail.com. So we hope to hear from you. Hi guys, so what I'm going to do is one of our most popular demos called Lycopodium. Uh, please don't try this at home, but if you do want to try it, go ahead and send us an email and join our club and we will teach you how to do it. So without further ado, in three, two, one. My name is Josh and I am the president of the Marine Awareness and Conservation Society, or MAPS, here at the University of Arizona. In our club, you're going to expect to learn and teach about the ocean during our many club meetings and outreaches. An outreach is when we go to a table at a school, a museum, or an event and talk to people of all ages about the ocean and what they can do to help even here in the desert. All majors are welcome and we look forward to seeing all of you soon. Hello fellow College of Science Associates. I am President President Ari Bermanis of MathCats, or Supreme Math Boy for short. We are the MathCats, the College of Science Math Club. Our vision is to show everyone that math can be beautiful. Yes, even you. But President Squared, math fills me with an existential state of dread and suffering. <coughs> what if I told you that that was at once me too? Now don't tell the College of Science this, but previously, in the darkest timeline, I was considering becoming a lawyer. It was only by pure chance my mind was in line to the ways of math. Now some say in line by, and some say broken by. The difference is purely pedantic, and nothing you need to concern yourself with, I assure you. Now what you should concern yourself with are the benefits of becoming a member. These benefits include, but are not limited to, cool shirts. We also have talks from professors, graduate students, and professionals working in mathematical fields. To top it all off, we have exclusive tutoring opportunities and will even teach you forbidden math techniques that you can practice in friendly competition against your peers with weekly or bi-weekly problem sets. If all that sounds fine and dandy to you and you wish to join our ranks, please send me an email at abramanis at email.arizona.edu. I will then add you to our email group which we use to announce meetings. Now coming to a meeting is always free, but if you want a shirt, you're going to have to pony up 10 bucks. On a more serious note, we're a very sociable club and would always love to have more members. So if anything I said sounds at all appealing to you, I'd urge you to come to our first meeting. Thank you so much for listening and stay positive out there.
Hi, my name is Philip, and I'm the president of the Neuroscience and Cognitive Science Association of Students, NSCSAS for short. We are the Neuroscience Department's largest student organization, and we meet every other week. If you're interested in the mind or the brain, and you want to meet other students who are also interested in those things, you should definitely consider joining us. The core idea of NSCSAS is to provide students with the opportunity to connect with peers, learn new things, and engage diverse voices within neuroscience and cognitive science. This is a means for students to find success within the field at large. I've been involved with NSCSAS for the past three years, and each year what we do is we issue surveys. Those are a way for us to ask questions to you all to make sure that the student's voice is truly represented within the club. One of my favorite experiences as a freshman in NSCSAS was the faculty potluck, during which all club members went to a professor's house one evening and shared food and had conversations. And this was a particularly good experience for me because I got to meet professors that, as a freshman, that normally I wouldn't have met until sophomore, junior year. Hey everybody, my name's Cam. I wanted to let you know that this club is for any science student. Whether you want something more focused on the clinical aspect, or you're looking for something in research, or somewhere in between all that, or if you're just looking for something with neuroscience, cognitive science, we can give you a community to help learn about all of that. Our officer team has been working all summer long to to transition into the virtual format. We're planning things like faculty presentations, pre-professional panels, virtual lab tours, and much more so that you can still be exposed to all the opportunities here at the University of Arizona. We meet every other week and our first meeting is on Monday, August 31st at 5 p.m. Contact us at nscsas.ua at gmail.com and we'll add you to our listserv for more updates. We hope you'll join our club. It's a no-brainer. Hello everyone and welcome to the U of A. My name is Kayla Shidwar and I'm this year's president of the Society of Earth Science Students, also known as CES Club. CES Club is a small undergraduate club that is open to all majors who are interested in the study of Earth and Life Sciences. We will be hosting bi-weekly formal meetings to discuss new opportunities and career prep for your future. We will also have social meetings in between, which will be centered on meeting your peers and forming new connections. Some of the benefits of joining CES are that you will have access to the CES Lounge, which is a great place to go in between classes. We will also be taking several hiking trips throughout the semester, and also will inform you of the research opportunities available to you. In February, CES Club volunteers at the Tucson Gem and Mineral Show, where we run the junior education booth and teach the next generation about our wonderful planet. We also go on an annual spring break trip where we visit one of the states surrounding Arizona. Last year, we went up to Glen Canyon, which is the photo seen here, and also up to Zion National Park and Snow Canyon State Park. The CES Club officers and I are committed to the safety of its members, and as such, our meetings will be online for most of the semester. But this won't stop us from trying to keep things fun. We already have several ideas of how to have safe and socially distant events, but you'll just have to join us to find out what they are. If you're interested in joining CES, please contact CESClubUofA at gmail.com. Also, if you would like, follow our Instagram, which is sess underscore U of A. I can't wait to meet you all, and here's to a great fall semester. Hello, my name is Cherry. Hi, my name is Lisa. Hi, my name is Chelsea. And we're the co-directors. Students for Sustainability is the largest student-run environmental organization on campus. We have six committees dedicated to institutionalizing sustainability and promoting environmental justice. In SFS, you can fight food insecurity by providing affordable produce to students every week during the farmer's market. Attend a sustainability summit in Tempe. Collaborate with the Office of Sustainability to install solar panels on top of the Environment and Natural Resources 2 building. Tour facilities management and work with them to retrofit buildings on campus. Teach students K-12 through about the environment. Curb plastic waste from landfills and weave mats out of plastic bags for the homeless population. 
Volunteer at our eco stations at Dusk Music Festival. Grow your own food at our community garden. No seeds? Visit our seed library and get access to hundreds of them for free. And so much more. Students for Sustainability provides opportunities for leadership experience by appointing two to three students to the executive board for each committee. It also connects students to staff and administrators from different fields by hosting guest speakers and SFS advisors at our meetings. You can even earn internship credits if approved by your advisor. Turn red and blue green and apply today.